We're into the real nail-biting session now, people, and that is we've got the chicken going. I stopped that from boiling for a little bit, steaming, steaming the asparagus. I put that on hold for a minute, but I'm going to stop that up again in a second. And I've still got the taters on board, on, on, in the oven, and they're cooking up something fierce. Aren't they, Gregory? I'm not talking to you anymore. After that little incident. Well, now look what I've done. I've put the knife into the cutting board. I've gone and made a little scratch mark in there. That, that wasn't very clever of me. That's not the kind of thing that a chef should do, is it, Gregory? I like to take some time to have a glass of port while the chicken is cooking, or whatever it is that's cooking. Gregory, would you like some, would you like some port? There you go. You enjoy that, Gregory. That's a lovely bouquet. Oh, this is going to taste delicious. Let's check on the chicken, Gregory. Oh, it's fine. It's fine. Seems to be doing well. I wonder where Esmeralda is. She said she'd be back by now. Let's give her a call, shall we? It's ringing. Oh, I forgot to dial 416, but Gregory, how could I have been so stupid? The dial tone's gone through. It's ringing. She's not answering. Oh, my God! Oh, good heavens! Gregory, get a shot of it. It's gone around the corner. Now it's time for the joke of the day. <laughs> child was at a wedding and when he went to when it became his turn to walk down the aisle he took a step a step and then went raw and then he took another step step raw and he did it all the way down to the altar step step raw step step raw everyone was laughing hysterically and then it became time when the father asked the young child young child my boy why did you do this and the child said, <laughs> What do you mean, Gregory? I can't say that word. I can't say what word. It's not even a dirty joke. Gregory, what's going on over there outside? Gregory, what is going on out here? Gregory, they're making an awful ruckus out here. Come on, look at this crazy. It seems as though the coppers have arrived. <laughs> the chicken is burning. Come on, let's go. I've locked us out, Gregory. You have the keys. Thank goodness, Gregory. I had the keys. Let's go back up to the kitchen. The chicken is burning. Close the door all the way. Gregory. Seriously, you have to close the door. Oh my God, Gregory. Gregory, where's my oven mitt? Right oh, good heavens. That is a stinging thing. Okay then, and put it on. Ooh! Mmm, so there's the asparagus. It was much nicer a little while ago, that's for sure. There's no question about that. There's our asparagus, and here's the chicken, which I've had heating in the oven for quite some time now. And this, I hope you don't mind, Gregory, that's going to be my piece. Hmm, and I'll leave this if Esmeralda ever comes home from a job working with the dogs at the kennel. Hmm. And lastly, the potatoes. Mmm, -hmm. mm, they're perfect. They're browned. That's just how I like them, Gregory. Mmm, 
there we go. Perfect. It's delicious, isn't it? Wait, you got one more than me. Now we're even. <laughs> well, I'll tell you, Gregory, I hope that lizard doesn't come back and pester us while we're eating our wonderful dinner. Because that would certainly be a horrible thing, wouldn't it? Now, for a wonderful meal, Gregory. A little more of the port, of the old vino, as they say. And I'll have a little swig of the...